In this video, I'm going to show you one of the functionality within the Power Pages site called as Log Off. Now, uh, I'm in one of the Power Pages site, okay, uh, which I've already provisioned it. So if I try signing into the application, uh, I will be redirected to the login page. And then once I click on sign in with an external account or Azure AD, uh, my credentials will be fetched and then I will be logged into the portal. Now, this is fine. I'm logged into the portal. Now, see what happens when I click on log off. Okay. The moment I click on log off, it will log you off from the system and it will throw you back in the home page. So this is the home page. Okay. Now, what if I don't want this behavior? What if the behavior which I want is once I log off, then I will be, I should be redirected to the sign in page again. Okay, so where to make those changes? Now, again, where are this uh, sign in, sign out button reside? So it resides in uh, the web template. Okay, so if you are in the Power Pages management site, now how to navigate to the Power Pages management site is go to the Design Studio, click on this three icon, uh, three dots, and click on this portal management. Then you will be landing in this page. Now here on the content, you will go to web templates and under web templates, you will find header. Now under header, you need to find some text, okay? So if I click within the header and I just say control F and I'll just say, let's say if I get this text, log out, okay? Yeah. Find the text, now here is that button, the sign off button or the log out button. Now let's, uh, look into the code what this code says it says it's an anchor tag and the sign out is a button or like link slash log out is a snippet through which you can log out from this application however where does this href takes you now this href will tells you over here that if it's a home url if the home url exists then navigate to the home page but that I don't want. What I want is to log in, uh, send the uh, the redirection to the uh, sign in sign up page. Okay. Now, in order to do that, what we need to do is you need to play around with this href. Okay. Now, I'll take all this href out. Okay. But before we take this href out, we need to understand some tags over here. Now, this tag is called as a website dot sign out URL substitution. So. There is a documentation in Microsoft Learn site. Um, this uh, URL will give you some information about the liquid objects. Now, one of the liquid objects, the attributes uh, for that table is listed here. Sign in URL and sign out URL. Substitution is a uh, sign in URL underscore substitution and sign out URL underscore substitution. Now, what is sign in URL? Sign in URL is nothing, but it is slash ENQS, sign in, question mark, written URL is, and then the substitution, okay? So if you see, this is how you form the URL, okay? Now, substitute page in this example replaces the default cached URL. Now, the default cached URL is in whenever, wherever page you reside, if you sign out, it will take you back to the sign in page, okay? Now, taking help of this particular uh, documentation, what I'm going to do is in the code where we have written website dot <coughs> sign out URL substitution. So this href, I will replace this entire href. So let me take this entire content out. I'll just put xxx. Okay. I have already placed this URL over here. Okay. Now I'll just copy this content and I'll explain it to you what, what I mean by that. Okay. So if I put a ahref is slash account slash login slash log off. Okay. So the, if anyone clicks on that sign out or log off link, they need to go into this part. Okay. And then the written URL is the sign out URL substitution. Okay and uh, rest all should remain same okay let me save this i'll put all this code in the description of the youtube video 
as well okay now what i've done i have made that change okay and once i made the change i'll just sync this up and once the configurations are synced we should be able to see the change in behavior now if you see over here now first we need to sign in once i sign in it will ask me for to log in within uh, azure ad external account so i log in now the earlier behavior was to uh, you know once you click on log off it uh, used to navigate to the home page okay but now post code change what should happen once i log off it should redirect me to the sign in page okay so if i click here now and if the changes persist then technically i should be uh, thrown back to the sign in page so and that's what this behavior has done so again going back to the code uh, let me again explain you what change we have made we have taken the ahref of the log off and then said that go into slash account sorry go into slash account slash login slash log off and then written url uh, that's the query string is website dot sign out url substitution again going back into the uh, documentation which will give you uh, sign out url substitution details which is already mentioned over here slash account slash login log off and then the substitution value and once you do that you will be able to achieve this result so that's it folks uh, thanks for watching this video uh, i'll see you in my next video thank you